you know, he showed me the bottle the where the lean was at, bro. It was like a little uh, bottle like the bro, like from the one. What's up, y'all? Due to the YouTube community guidelines, if you are under 18, get the fuck out. What's up, guys? It's your boy XO coming back at you with another video. Today's video, guys, is gonna be uh it's gonna be story time about my first time trying lean and my experience with that shit. So uh let's uh, hop to the video. So uh this shit was this shit was a while ago, bro. Like this was like back in 2007, 2008. So it was like over 10 years ago and shit, bro. Like I still kind of remember that shit, bro. I was like um I think I was like 12, 11 years old, bro. I was like around that age and shit, bro. You feel me? I was like youngster and shit, bro. Like man, it's crazy, bro. I was like a little ass kid doing shit like this, bro. I remember that day, me and my mama, uh, we had went to my cousin's house. And uh, at my cousin's house, uh, one of his friends, you feel me, was was at his house and shit. So you feel me, when I walked in there, I'm like, oh shit, you feel me, I said, what's up to both of them? And uh, they was talking about, um, they was talking about like different kind of drugs and shit, like about weed, pills, coke, uh, crack, about shit like that, bro. And um, lean got brought up, but, um, but back in the day, bro, like back in that time, like we didn't use, we didn't call that shit lean or dirty Sprite or none of that shit, bro. Like we, we call that shit bow. Like people used to be like, oh, I'm sipping on bow or uh, I'm leaning on bow. People used to be calling that shit bow if we didn't call it lean, dirty Sprite or none of that shit, bro. I remember, um, I remember my cousin's friend was talking about how you could find that shit at uh, your mama's or your grandparents' medicine cabinet and shit, bro. How Usually, it's like a little orange uh, container, like the ones you get prescribed at Walgreens. And that in the label, it should read permethacine codeine and shit. Like, it should have permethacine codeine on the label. And it should be purplish, that the, the liquid is dark, it's like purple and shit, bro. He said, when you find that shit, that, that motherfucker's some good shit, bro. He said that he had found some before, and he had took like nine spoon shots. And that he was, he was, he was tripping and shit, bro. At that time, I, I, I had found that shit kind of weird how medicine could get you high or you feel me, good. Have you tripping balls, you feel me, how he was describing it. So I'm like, you feel me, uh, what the fuck, it sounds, it sounds interesting, you feel me, uh, I'm trying to try that shit. I remember, uh, I was trying to, I remember I had told myself, when I get to the house, bro, I'm about to go through my mama's medicine cabinet and I'm gonna see if I can find some of this shit, bro. And if I find this shit, <laughs> I'm about to drink the whole bottle that night, bro. I'm like, man, like, I was kind of fiending for that shit, bro. I'm like, man, I'm trying to try that shit, no lie. Um, I remember me and my mama, we ended up leaving, and we went to the, we went to the house. And uh, I remember when we got to the house and shit, I waited till everybody went to sleep, bro. I remember I stayed up till, like, um, 12 or 1 in the morning. Like, I stayed up hella fucking late, bro. And I remember uh, once everybody was asleep, I made my way to the kitchen. And I opened my, my mama's medicine cabinet and I started going through, you feel me, the, the medicine bottles. I started reading the labels and shit. And mostly it was just like, like hella weird type of names and shit, bro. None of them said permethacine, codeine, or no shit like that, bro. And none of them were like, like purple, you feel me? None of the, the medicine shit were like purples or none like that shit. So I'm like, man, that's some fucking bullshit, bro. I'm a rock, I got kind of mad and shit. I went, I went back to sleep disappointed and shit. So, uh, like, three or four days later had passed, and uh, I get a call from my cousin. He called me. He's like, he's like bro, uh, what you doing this weekend? I'm like, uh, shit, bro. If anything, probably should do homework and you feel me chill at the house. He's like, bro, I was at my granny house uh, last week, and uh, I was I went through her medicine cabinet and shit, and uh, I found some, I found some, some, some bow. Feel me? He's like, I found some promethazine codeine, and he said, uh, he told me he was like, uh. I had, uh, he told me he had took some shots. Uh, he told me he had took like five or six uh, spoon shots and that that shit had him tripping yesterday, bro. He said that yesterday, that the, the day before he called me, he said he had took like five uh, spoon shots and that that shit had him tripping and shit, bro. He was on, like he was on like the whole day, bro. Like he said that he felt like he was tired and shit, bro. Like, but he, he was like, like the whole day he was hella fucking tired and shit, bro. She was glued to the couch. <laughs> so you feel me? I'm like, oh, yup, I'm up there. You feel me? I'm going up there this Saturday. I remember uh, Friday had came. I was at school. You feel me? Friday had came. And right after school, uh, when my mama picked me up, I had told my mama, I'm like, hey, mama, can you drop me up at my cousin's house? She's like, yeah, you feel me? It's cool. 
So you, you feel me? We, we made our way over there. She had dropped me off. I got down. Went to my cousin's room and shit. I was sort of like, hey, what's up, bro? For me, so what's up? And uh, he showed me the bottle the where the lean was at, bro. It was like a little uh, bottle like this, bro. Uh, the ones for Walgreens and shit. And uh, it said uh, his granny name on it. And uh, it said uh, Permethacine Codeine on it and shit, bro. I remember it was like this full and shit. And it was purple, bro. It was like dark and shit, bro. I remember like, oh shit, like like this motherfucker actually found some real ball, bro. Like, goddamn, like, that's crazy, bro. So you feel me? Me, you feel me? I was a little bit too excited to try that shit. So quickly, I poured me like two or three spoon shots and I just took them bitches down. That shit tasted like straight fucking medicine, bro. That shit, that shit tasted nasty, bro. Like I had one to give me a water bottle. So I can take the flavor out of my mouth and shit, bro. So I'm like, oh shit, yo, we about to be leaning today. So uh, after uh, my seven or eighth uh, spoon shot, that's when I like like starting to feel that shit, like like on my knees and shit, bro. Like when you start feeling buzzed, you feel me? When you start getting like drunk and shit, you start feeling that shit in your legs and shit. You feel me? Uh, you start like you feel me like feeling kind of like like buzz and shit, bro. That's how I start feeling that shit. I'm like, oh shit, like, I'm starting to feel that shit. You feel me? Like, bro. Like last week we was just talking about that shit and now we got some fucking bowl, bro. I remember um we was in my cousin's room. We was chilling right there, we was watching TV, bro, we was watching movies and shit. I, I don't really remember what movie we was watching, bro. I can't really remember what movies we was watching at this moment, bro. But I wasn't really paying attention to the movies and shit, bro. I was already like kind of tripping and shit, bro. I remember I was I was uh, sitting down. He had like a little uh, one seater couch in his room, bro. And I was sitting down in that shit. And like, every time I try to move, bro, like I just feel hella weak, bro. Like, like when you're in the dream, bro, when you, you ever guys, you ever guys dream about like running and shit and like you just feel hella slow, bro. Like no matter how like hard you try to run fast, bro, like you just feel hella slow, bro. That's how I literally felt, bro. Like I was just glued to the couch, bro. Like trying to move and shit. But I just felt like slow, bro, like hella fucking weak. Like, man, like this shit got me tripping, bro. So uh, then I had to go use the bathroom, bro. So I try to get up. But every time like I push myself to get up, like I felt like some shit pushing me back, back down, bro. Like I just couldn't, I couldn't like lift up my own body weight, bro. Like I was tripping and shit. I'm like, man, what the fuck? I tried so many times to get up, bro. I just couldn't fucking get up, like. Every time I got up from the seat, bro, I just felt like some shit just pushed me back down. So I'm like, man, like, bro, I'm fucking tripping, bro. I gotta use, I gotta go use the bathroom and I can't even fucking get up. It's like, god damn. It was like on some weird high shit, bro. Like, like, what the fuck, bro? Like, I dead ass couldn't get up, bro. Like, I felt like some shit kept pushing me back down. I remember feeling like I was like in slow motion, bro. Like, bro, I was just chilling there, bro. And like every time I moved, bro, like I just felt like I was moving like in slow motion, bro. Like, 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 man, like it's like it's weird to explain, bro. <laughs> it's just like, man, like that shit had me moving like in slow motion and shit, bro. It's like weird and shit. Like you feel tired, bro. Like you feel hella fucking heavy and shit, bro. Like if you try to move your arm and shit, bro, like you can't really move, bro. Like you just feel like stuck. It's like a feeling like like way stronger than we, like. Hey, fucking stronger than weed, bro. Like, man, like, when you sip some lean, bro, like, like when that shit actually has you leaning, bro, like, that shit's, like, ten times stronger than smoking fire-ass cartridge or a blunt, bro. Like, man, like, that motherfucker will have you stuck, bro. You just like this, bro. Like, man, bro, like, it's crazy. So, like, two or three hours had passed, bro, and I still, feel me, I still couldn't go to the bathroom, bro. Like, I was, like, literally stuck to the fucking seat, bro. Like, man, like, what the fuck? And I was looking at my cousin trying to get up too, and he couldn't get up neither, bro. Like, we was both stuck to the seat, like, man, like, we was just all stuck to the fucking backseat and shit, bro. We was, like, forced to watch the fucking movies and shit, bro. Like, I was, man, bro, I had to use the bathroom and shit, bro. I had to take a big-ass piss. I couldn't fucking get up on the fucking seat, bro. Then I remember I had told my cousin, I'm like, bro, you feel me? Pass me, pass me the bottle. I'm about to pull me, for me, pull me another two, two or three spoon shots. And uh, he gonna be like, like, nah, bro, you feel me? Uh, we already pulled up a lot, woo, woo, woo. I'm like, bro, nah, bro, feel me? Pass me the bottle, bro. <laughs> like, like seriously, bro, like, give me the fucking bottle, bro. Like, I'm trying to pull up, bro. He was like, nah, bro, like, you, you, you already high and shit. I'm already high, like, you feel me? We already cool. We don't need no more. We don't need no more boat. 
I'm like, bro, give me the bottle, bro. I'm trying to take one more. You feel me? I try at least one more spoon shot, if anything. So he's like, all right. So he passed me the bottle one more time. So I took the last spoon shot, bro. You feel me? And man, bro, I feel like the last spoon shot, like, actually boosted up my, my high. You feel me? Like, that motherfucker actually boosted up my, my high and shit, bro. And, uh, man, bro, like, I was just fucking, man, I was out of it, bro. My mouth was hella fucking dry and shit, bro. Um, I felt fucking tired and shit. I feel like I was in slow motion, bro. Like, I couldn't really move and shit, bro. It's just like in a dream and shit, bro. In a dream when you try, like, like when you in a fight or something, or when you trying to r run away from something, like, yo, you feel stuck, bro. You feel like you can't fucking move and shit, bro. It's like, man, it's like weird feeling. So, uh, I ended up knocking out right there on my fucking cousin's couch, bro. Like, I don't remember how, when, bro. I should remember I was right there. We were watching a movie. Next minute you know, I woke up and it's already the next day and shit, bro. I woke up with kind of like, like a hangover and shit, bro. Like my mouth was hella dry and shit. Uh, I didn't really have a headache, bro. But like my head did feel kind of weird and shit. Like kind of like light, bro. Like like on some weird shit. I guess it was like a little hangover from the, from the fucking, uh, from leaning and shit, bro. Like man, bro. Like that shit had me fucking tripping balls, bro. Like man. Like, I don't even think I got up to use the bathroom, bro. I think I used the bathroom, like, the whole other day and shit, bro. Like, I couldn't fucking get up on that seat, bro. Like, that's how fucking on I was, bro. I took at least, bro, at least we took... Me, personally, I at least took, like, like at least 12 spoon shots of that shit, bro. Like, I took hella fucking spoon shots of that shit. Like, man, bro. I was doing the most, bro. Like, I was fiending for that shit. And uh, after that day, I never really did sip lean again, bro. Like, lean was never really, like, my thing to do and shit, bro. One, it was kind of hard to get. Two, just motherfuckers be taxing and shit, bro. Motherfuckers be trying to sell you an ounce for, like, 50 60 70 dollars, bro. Like, that purple shit, that permethazine with codeine. I ain't paying no 80 dollars for an ounce, bro. That's way too much for just one fucking ounce. That shit ain't gonna do shit to you. So, feel me, lean, it's not really, it's not really, like, my type of thing to do, bro. Me, I have always smoke weed, bro. That's my thing to do, smoke weed. And if I'm at a party or if I go to a club or something, then, feel me, I'm, I'm taking a couple of shots. But other than that, I don't fuck with no, no other shit, anything like that, bro. So, yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. You feel me, um, gonna be the end of my story. Um, I don't want to encourage nobody to go out there and try lean or none of that shit or no drugs, bro. I'm just, this is basically just a story about my experience, about my first time uh, with lean and all that shit. So, you know, I hope, I hope you guys enjoy my story. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And see you guys next time.